Hi there, I'm Teresa, and today I'm gonna to walk you through an easy ruffled scarf pattern made with Red Heart's new Boutique Sassy Yarn. This unique ruffle yarn is available in fabric and lace hanks. Sassy fabric is a soft, sheer fabric strip with evenly spaced holes to make it easy to knit. The fashion prints include polka dots and animal prints in sophisticated shades. The Sassy Lace is made of sheer lace that has holes woven into the top edges so you can easily knit into it. I love the romantic look this adds to any outfit. Here I'll show you how to knit a boutique-worthy scarf made with Sassy Lace and Sassy Fabric. It's really easy, even a beginner can do it. To start the pattern for the Sassy Scarf, you'll need one hank of Red Heart Boutique Sassy Lace and size nine knitting needles, plus a sewing needle and matching sewing thread. Now before you start, slide the ball band to one end of the hank and remove the cardboard from the center of the hank. Note that you wanna begin your scarf with the inside end of Sassy Lace and continue pulling from inside as you knit. Now you'll see that the fabric has holes running along one side. You'll be knitting into each hole. To cast on, start about three inches from one end. I'll go into the fourth hole here. And insert the needle from back to front through the next five holes. That's three, four, five. Okay, just to make this easier, I'm gonna move my hank to the right side. Pick up your right hand needle and knit into each hole. Into the first hole. And into the second one. And just knit into the all five holes. Continue knitting these five stitches on each row. And that's your first row of stitches. So just knit into your next row. And you'll find that this lace yarn is pretty soft. So it kind of just glides right through. Stop knitting when you have one yard left for binding off. Bind off as usual and pull the end of the fabric through the last bound off stitch and then tighten. And to finish the ends, fold under the edge to tack inside with a sewing needle and matching thread. Or you can just trim the ends so they blend in with the rest of the ruffles. And there you have it. There's your lace scarf. Knitting with sassy fabric is very similar to knitting with sassy lace. You'll notice holes running along one side. Insert the needle four times from back to front through each hole at the top of the fabric. Pick up the right hand needle and knit into each hole. Continue knitting these four stitches on each row. Finish your row. Bind off as usual, pulling the end of the fabric through the last bound off stitch and tighten. Trim leaving a three inch end. And then to finish the ends, fold under the edge and tack inside with your sewing needle and matching thread. Now you have two sassy scarves to wear day or night. Learn more about this beautiful new yarn at redheart.com.